Welcome to another episode of Tinkering Experiments. In this episode, we will be trying to smooth out our PLA with our rock tumbler once again. Instead of the wet sand that we had in the previous experiment, we dried it out, so we will be using the dried out sand. If you remember from our other experiment, we used the polymeric sand, but it was a bit too wet, so the results didn't actually come out nicely. So this time we actually left the polymeric sand in the sun to dry the moisture out of it. I wonder if it will give us better results. Let's start. We'll move the sand over into the tumbler. Before we put our print in the tumbler, let's take a look at it first. Here we have a cube that hasn't been processed before. The layers are really apparent and we can definitely feel them. We can also still see that gloss in on this PLA cube. Let's drop the print in and then we'll secure it. Put it into our mount and then we can start our experiment. Okay, we'll start now and we'll leave this inside the tumbler for a week and see how it goes. It's been tumbling for a week now. Let's take it out and we'll take a look at the print closely. Well, this time the sand is not sticking to the sides of the wall, so that's a good sign. So maybe we have better results than before. We'll move on to the print after I wash it off. Just like the wet sand experiment, we can see the corners on the cube has definitely been in the most contact with the sand as we can see it being um, more white. I'm not too sure why the middle part of the cube isn't being sanded or post-processed um, like the corners. I wonder if our speed has to do it with anything. Maybe it's spinning too fast and there's not enough time for it to actually go through that's causing this to happen resulting in the center doesn't seem to be touched a lot by the sand but the color is still matted than before here's a comparison to one that wasn't put into the tumbler we can definitely spot the differences between the two especially on the corners but other than that the middle part is relatively the same and they are very similar the only other thing that is different is the one that we put into the tumbler is more matte in color like what we previously witnessed. Well, there we have it. We tried to smooth our PLA print with polymeric sand after we dried it out, and it didn't work as I intended it to. The corners are smoothed out though when we compare it to the other cubes that wasn't post-processed. I'm not too sure why it's turning out like this where the middle part of the cube isn't really being post-processed. Um, maybe we just have to adjust the speed or settings for the tumbler to give us better results. Before I end, I just want to remind everyone about Tinkering U. The platform has a lot of teaching resources on 3D printing and how you can incorporate it into your curriculum. So be sure to check it out. That's the end of our experiment. If you liked our video, please give us a thumbs up and if you did not, then a thumbs down below. Remember to subscribe and comment on what experiments you would like to see in the future. Thank you for watching. Tinker out.